Hello everyone, welcome to day four of Convertible Solutions Virtual Trade Show. Pete and I are here with you again. How are you doing this morning, Pete? I'm doing good, thanks. Great. Today we're gonna to talk about our True Flat product. It's a great product, it's really fun to work with. Pete, why don't you start with the technical pieces? Sure, you bet. So again, today we're talking about True Flat. True Flat paper is one of our products that we have that let you make small run, brochures, menus, and those kind of things. What we've noticed that over the years is that the market has swayed away from photo books a little bit, but we still have this great paper, so we've developed a way to have our customers make brochures that we've talked about. So just like any multi-loft product, this is going to work the same way, Laura. You'll put the paper in your press. Let's say it's a six-page, three-sheet brochure. With that, you'll load your graphics, load your paper. You'll run the sheets through the digital press. You'll image one spread per sheet, and then after that, you take it to your finishing department. I've got a few samples of this to show you what we're talking about. So in these three sheets right here, these would be the printed sheets for your six page, three sheet brochure. Now what we've done is we've taken these to the bindery and we've actually folded these image to the inside, glue to the outside. And we've done that for a specific reason. If you've seen some of our other videos, we have a long video demonstrating just how to make true flat books and brochures. This is the actual jig that we use in those videos. This is kind of like a cartridge or a jig, and what it does, it keeps all the sheets aligned and square. That way when you apply pressure to them, they stay in alignment. So I'm simply going to take the lid, the top, off the cartridge, and we're going to start putting the sheets in one at a time that we folded to put inside the jig. So we're going to lay this one, first one in, and we're just going to kind of push it down very gently to get it seated. We'll then take the second sheet, We'll put this in and very lightly, I'm going to tack this down with my fingers just to give it a slight tack so it'll hold properly. We'll then get the last sheet, which is actually the cover, and we're going to put this in as well and we're going to do the exact same thing. Now one of the cool things about this cartridge is that you can actually make multiple three sheet brochures. So if this was a case where I had say 10, say the order was 10, Laura, what I would do then at this point is I would put a slip sheet of any of your house papers into the jig that will separate this three sheet book from the next three sheet book. That's very important because if you don't do that and you apply pressure, you're gonna have a 30 sheet book instead of 10 <laughs> three sheets book. So that, that's the important part. What you'll do at this point, let's say that it was just one that you're making, you'll take this, put the lid back on, and you'll take it to your platen press. Now at Convertible Solutions, you can call us, you can talk to us. We have several platen presses that we recommend, but you can take this, you put the whole entire cartridge into the platen press, you apply the pressure, it'll seal. I'm just gonna kinda tap this down a little bit so it'll tack, that way you can kinda get the idea. We'll take the lid off, I'm then gonna take out the book that is sealed I'm going to open this up, and this is called a self-wrap book, Laura. What we're going to do is we're going to take this sheet out, take the signature out, excuse me, and we're just simply going to wrap the cover right around. It's going to be self-covered that way. At this point, you could take this book, put it back into your jig, and then also at this point, Laura, if you have 10 sets of these, you wouldn't need to slip sheet it anymore. Since you wrap the cover around, it's going to act as a protector for the glues. So we'll take the lid and we'll put it back onto the cartridge. At this point, we'll take it back to the bindery, take it to your platen press, and we'll apply pressure one more time. The inside of the pages were already sealed once, but what this is going to do now, since we wrap the cover around, Laura, it's going to allow the cover to be sealed to the body of the book. I'm gonna tap this down a little bit again just to simulate the sealing aspect. So at this point, you have a six page, three sheet brochure, We'd have to take it to our trimmer, of course, and they'll take it out and they'll do the final trim to get it to size. And I think you might have a copy of it right there that would be the exact same uh, book that we're doing. Now, if I lay this out a little bit here on the table for everybody to see, the way this worked, you have three sheets, six pages. So this is one sheet of paper, this is one sheet of paper, and then the cover wrap is the third sheet of paper. By doing this, you can have a very effective way for on-demand prints, short run, color, variable data, whatever your digital press can do, you'll be able to work that into the project and you can make yourself a true flat brochure. Thanks, Pete. That was some great information. You bet. I'm going to go into some different ideas. Pete mentioned menus, he mentioned brochures, and he mentioned some event programs. So what I have here is a menu that we did. This is actually a six-page menu. Many of you who may have worked in books before may say six pages. That's absolutely not possible in a booklet-style brochure. But with Convertible Solutions True Flat, it is. So with this particular menu, we were able to take this. Of course, we have our regular menu items. We were also able to take this photograph and go all the way across the book, and we didn't lose any of the information in the gutter. 
Then we have our second spread. We have this great photograph of some wines for our wine list. Again, not losing any information in the gutter. And then the back of that for a really nice, it's just a really great piece that you can have in your restaurant or wherever it is that you're at. Yep. Another thing that we did is a brochure for a home remodeling company. So this one is a little bit different. This is the one that Pete actually showed you. One of the things that we did that was a little different with this piece is we took one of our multi-loft sheets for the cover. It gives the cover just a slightly heavier feel. We recommend using um, possibly our 100 pound smooth or our pearl cover, and you can get just a little bit heavier feel on, for the outside yeah. of that brochure. But as you open it up, we're still using our true flat here. You have this great kitchen that goes all the way across there, not losing anything in that gutter. You get a lot of really good information. You're able to showcase what it is you're doing. Yeah. This is really great for real estate. If you've got somebody that has high-end housing, yeah, very much as so. you, they can print this, they can do a custom piece, and your buyers are gonna walk away with something that's very, very special for that house that yep. they're looking at. Yep. The last thing that we have is the smallest book that we can do with this. It's a five by five. This would actually be two up on the true flat sheet. Yep. So this is also a six page brochure, which is three of the sheets. We have the cover that we've made. Open that up to the front, you're able to get a little bit of photography in the front of that mm -hmm. yeah, and a little bit nice. of information. And then go on to explain what's going on with your event. So it's, a, it's just a great little piece. These are some awesome books. They're easy, to, they're easy to design for because you design in spreads. And they give people a different idea of what a booklet brochure mm -hmm. is. So Laura, what if somebody went to our website, requested these papers, but they didn't want to go through the process of developing graphics just for test printing. Can you help them out there? Absolutely, I can, Pete. We actually provide graphics for each of these things on the website for free to you. And we also leave our information off of there. So if you want to use these graphics for your business, you can put your logo on the back mm. of that, print them up, and use them for your customers. Yeah, that make it super easy then, won't it? It does. Yep. So how many different size brochures or books can you make with this one template? You can make eight different sizes of brochures. With, with the this. same sheet of paper. With the same sheet of paper. Yeah. <laughs> and we've had customers and you've had projects that it wasn't simply just three sheets of paper. It could be four sheets, it could be five sheets, it could be six sheets. It really doesn't matter. It just depends on the project you're working on. That's correct, Pete. Yep. That brings us to the end of day four of the Convertible Solutions Virtual Trade Show. We've enjoyed talking to you about our True Flat product. As always, you can reach out to us at info at convertiblesolutions.com to request your virtual trade show sample pack. We enjoy bringing these to you each week, and we hope, as always, that you stay safe. Thank you.